it's Renee. Welcome to my channel. So this is my first haul back in a while. Uh, we are currently going through quarantine still. Do you guys like my hair? It's pink. It's more pink in person and like in photos, but the top's really pink. But yeah, this is my first haul back in a while. Um, I've been gone. I was gonna post a bunch of stuff before all this happened and then I had to quickly move out of my dorm room and move back home. So here I am in my bedroom. And if you're wondering, hey Renee, why are you wearing a jean jacket at like 2 a.m.? I just finished trying on all those swimsuits and I didn't feel like wearing a bra. So, can't tell, right? Can you? But yeah, it's been some time. I was gonna post like this big old life update video where I got really like emotional and I was like saying how happy I was and like how well I was doing. And then um, COVID-19 happened and um, all of that was reversed. And now I'm home and miserable. So yeah, now we're here. Now we're making hauls because I have the free time. This is to say I am very privileged. I am lucky enough to still have a job. I am healthy, I am safe, I am okay. I have a place to be, but yeah, overall I am okay. I hope that wherever you are, that you are okay. To all the essential workers out there, medical workers, undocumented workers, any person who is providing like backbone to society, essential work right now, thank you for everything you're doing. You are appreciated by me, but underappreciated by so many. Um, yeah, but because summer's canceled, let's check out some swimsuits because I ordered a bunch of stuff from ASOS. I've been ordering now from ASOS for a while. I just haven't really been posting anything about it, but ASOS is one of my like new favorite stores. And it's just so, so great. Love a lot of their stuff. Some of their stuff is okay. Some of their sizing's a little weird, but a lot of their stuff I think is really, really good. If you want to get into this haul and see all the swimsuits that I bought, all the ones I tried on, give you kind of my overview on what I think of ASOS's stuff, stay tuned and we'll get into it. Okay, so for swimsuit number one, I really like this one a lot. I think it's very cute. Here's a little like quick overview of every single ASOS swimsuit that I tried. Every single one, I think they're really, really cute, but they are only for when I'm hanging out with friends or like going to the beach with friends. I could never wear any of these to like to going to a pool or a beach, which I know are all closed and summer's canceled, but I already bought these before summer was canceled. So yeah, but I could never wear any of these really with the pool or to the pool with my nieces and my nephew. The bottoms, yes. The tops, no. The tops are full on boob shows. They are like, like, you can see everything. And some of them are more covered than others, but either way, they're all kind of very booby. So yeah, first one is this really, really cute. It's white and orange and has all these flowers all over it. It is actually from Peek and Bow because it's P-E-K and little and sign and then B-E-A-U. Yeah, it's really cute, really high-waisted. It's a size 26. And then actually most of these, all of these are matching except for I did buy one top to go with a bunch of my other things. Pretty much all of these are matching. This has a, oh wait, is this the bottom? These are the bottoms. These are the bottoms right here. This one I was holding before is the top. But yeah, really cute. I like the white. I like all the flowers. I think it's really fun to have like a white swimsuit because fat people are always told that we can't wear white. And in reality, I'm gonna do what I want like you can't tell me what to do, so whatever. <laughs> but yeah, this one is actually a wrap top bodysuit. And you'd think that because it was like that, you're like, oh, it might show like a little bit of cleavage, but it won't be too bad. And then you're like, oh, my whole titty is out. Oh no. So Hi, um, editing Renee. I actually would like to slightly recant this. I've discovered that if you pull your chest out separately and you don't like hike them up and try to adjust them, it actually sits there fine. But definitely if you try to adjust anything, it definitely does show off more of your boobs than you originally planned. You have to like cover it up and pull it more. But the reason I bought this is because my biggest issue is that I always get burnt because I'm very white. Even though I put sunscreen on, I get burnt whenever I go to the pool, whenever I go to the beach. I'd rather not get burnt all the time when I'm out. So I was like, let's buy some things with like little cap sleeves. This way my shoulders don't get burnt, my back doesn't get burnt. I just dropped the bottoms. And I was like, okay, yeah, this is a great idea. Love this, 10 out of 10. It's a super cute, super, super cute color and a really cute print. Something like I said that I will definitely wear when I'm like hanging out with friends or going to the beach with friends, that's fine. Totally fine, really cute, really stylish. 
would be really cute for Instagram. But yeah, if you're looking for things with cute little ca um, cap sleeves, kind of like this, ASOS has a few of them. And if you're like me, where you get burned really easily, it might be a really good idea. This way, you can still put sunscreen on, you can still go swimming, but you're gonna lessen your chance of getting burnt. The world's getting hotter, we're all gonna burn in a hot fire. Wear sunscreen. So here is another one. So a lot of the tops, that one was actually a very tame top, the last one in comparison, because it was at least more covered. These ones, I, there are a lot of them came in like triangle tops. So this is a really cool, like unique print. This is from the ASOS swim line. So it's this really cool, like almost like designer print. And then it has this kind of funky black and silver band underneath. And then here are the bottoms that go with it. And they're really cool and really unique. Like you don't see a lot of prints like this. Again, titty show, major titty show. Like honestly, kind of a butt show. Uh, again, hanging out with friends, not for a community pool. I can't go outside like this when I have small children. Well, I mean, I guess I could, but I don't know. I just don't want I just don't want to put up with that. People will call you out for anything. But yeah, I think the colors are really beautiful. It's got this kind of cool, they're almost like pastel jewel tones because they have like this cool like periwinkle color, a really pretty like pink and orange color. I think it's just such a cute set. Like it's so fun, it's so cute, but it offers no support. And I get that it's a swimsuit, but it offers no support. Like there's like nothing for nothing. The bottoms I will definitely wear because I think the bottoms are practical. I can wear them, they're fine. I can wear them with like a black top, that's okay. These won't wear all the time, already took the tags off, too late. Still really cute though. It's a cute ass set. I feel like I look really cute in it. It's just not practical for every day, unfortunately, because it's really fun and really cute. And ASOS, most of their tops and bottoms, like the price average is like $20 to $25 each. So like really cheap for plus size. All of these, by the way, are in a size 26 because that is typically the biggest size that ASOS goes up to. And that's something I did learn too. If you wanna make these less cheeky from uh, Jasmine J on Instagram, she's like one of the buzz, she's originally from like Buzzfeed. If you go from the front, and you turn it around and make the front the back on a swimsuit. It makes it more high-waisted, gives you more coverage in the front, it makes it a little cheeky in the back, which I think is a little bit, it's a little bit easier and a little bit better and it makes things more comfortable because the front actually has a lot less coverage on this because it's one of those high-cut ones, which I don't really like, but I thought I would just do that and it turns out fun and I think it's really cute. Okay, another one, adorable, great, Really cool fall color that you can definitely wear in the summer. This is again from Peak and Bow. This is a size 26. Matching swim top. Again, titty show. Like, just <laughs> so much titty all the time. And I think it's so cute because this has, it's like ribbed. It has a fun tie in the front to give you like a little belt, accentuate your waist a little bit. I think I look great in it. But titty show. <laughs> like, how many times? Take a shot for every time, or take a shot of water for every time I say titty shot because or titty because it's just like, there's so much in all of these swimsuits and they're really cute. It does have a thin back. The backs on a lot of these have like a really thin back, which I don't totally like. I like to be covered because it, there goes the bottom. Cause it gives me more support, which I like. But yeah, triangle top. This one has a tie one, whereas the other one was straps. So you could actually tighten and adjust. This one you can actually tighten. So it gives you a little bit more support, but the cut right here is so intense that it's like, it starts like that. And so you're like, oh, titty, gotcha. When I say titty, I mean like T-I-D-D-I-E because I think that's more fun. I will definitely wear the bottoms maybe with like a black top, but I really just can't wear the top as is if I'm gonna go hang out. But again, who cares? Summer's canceled. I'm just showing you all these cute swimsuits for the summer that we're all gonna miss. Fuck it, why not? Cute though, again, a little bit high-waisted in the front more so, like a high cut. Take the front, when you put it on, turn around to the back, Stomach gets a little bit more coverage. You get a little bit of a cheekier cut in the back. I think it's a little bit more trendy and a little bit more fun. I just think it's cute. It's a great color and it's lined with black, so it's not gonna be see-through when you put it on. But the top, the top is just not totally doable for me, at least not all the time. I can't find the top for these. I actually really like these bottoms a lot. The top's gone, even though I just had to try on. Well, I guess the top for this- Um, hi again. So I still couldn't find it. I still can't find it now. And the only proof that I have that that top ever existed is the try-on. I'm sure I'll find it one day, but for now it's missing. And I, yeah, I, I don't know where it is. It's gone. You'll see it in the try-on. The, try the top was a, like, or is a triangle top again. It is a lot thicker in the back, but it has an open clasp front. It is, like, the most exposed, <laughs> I think, out of all of them. And the straps are incredibly loose. But if I got it in a size smaller, it wouldn't fit because it would be too small in the back, but the front is like, there's just not enough fabric. But I think the front clasp was really cute. I thought that would make it a lot better. I thought maybe about turning it around, which I haven't tried, and I'll let you know if I do that, if I apparently ever find it again, because I guess it's just gone. But these are the bottoms. They're a really cool, like textured rust color. And I really, really like them. These are from ASOS Swim, and I really like them. I like how they feel. I think it's a really cute color. I think it fits me really well in the back, and the bottoms fit me really well. The top isn't quite right. If you 
you have a bigger chest, and you need support, I recommend checking out their bottoms. If you want a matching swimsuit, I don't really think that they are for you because a lot of their tops are triangle tops, like all the cute ones I think are. And if that's totally your style and you wanna wear that, totally fine, go for it, 100% do you. But if that's not your style, maybe just check out the bottom. Bottoms are pretty good. They're pretty stretchy, they're nice, they're comfortable. I think they'll, they'll be great for whenever we can go swimming again. And I really like this. I, like I said, I think the color is unique and I've never owned like an orange swimsuit before. And again, all of these are, they're really affordable and they actually do feel really nice and like high quality and they feel decent because it is exhausting. To, I love Torrid, but it, it's exhausting to go to Torrid and to be like, okay, let's pay for these $40 bottoms and this $60 top if I want to pay full price or I'll maybe I'll get lucky and find some really cute things on sale. And that is the thing that's possible, but it would just be nice to go on ASOS and be like, oh, that's cute. That's cute. Oh, and like this swimsuit's only going to cost me like 40 bucks. All of these I got on sale, <laughs> like pretty much all of these I think this one might have been full price but the tops are usually or the bottoms are usually cheaper than the top so it wasn't as bad I like it I like how everything is high-waisted I just wish the tops were different I just wish they were different because they're not for me if you have a smaller chest and you're more of a pear shape I think that a lot of these will work for you if you're an apple shape or you have just a bigger chest I don't think a lot of these tops or a lot of these swimsuits will work for you now back to what I was saying earlier about how I get burnt really easily I, I just do I'm white earth's on fire it's inevitable but so I was like okay let's get this super neon pink swimsuit. Love it, cute as fuck. Has little ties on the side. Reminds me of the early 2000s because everything had this. And then it had a matching swim top. Love it, 10 out of 10, great. Actually don't really have that many bad things to say about it. Again, great for cap sleeves. Great if you have an issue getting burnt. This one, I'm definitely, I'm gonna wear the, them backwards because they are a high cut. Oh, that's the wrong way. Oh, these are inside out. So see, it's much more pink, actually. These are very high cut. So if you are more of a pear shape or do you just have a smaller belly or you want to have like a little bit of belly you want to show off, who cares? Fuck it, go for it. Pretty cute, pretty great. I'm going to wear it backwards because it is a high cut just because it'll give me a little bit more coverage in the front. front. I untied this and I'm going to tie these into bows. The top has a little matching tie as well. And it has kind of like, it doesn't come down super far. I think this will match really well with a lot of the other bottoms. I just dropped the bottoms. Match really well with a couple of other bottoms that I have. And I think that it is really cute together. These suits are great. <laughs> like they are. I think they're really comfortable. They're really good. I don't feel like squished or squeezed into any of them. I just think they could maybe use like a tad more fabric in the top. Just a hint. I can deal with less fabric in the bottoms. I'll deal with it. The top, I just need like a touch more. But I think that this is really pretty. I think it's really fun. I think it's really fresh and fun. And in person, like if you saw my hair in person in the daytime, my hair looks way pinker. Like in photos, it looks way pinker. This goes great. Now for the final thing, something I really have always struggled with is finding a white swim top because they're like impossible to find in plus size and I have a lot of bottoms that would look good with just wearing white on top. So I got this. It's really cute. It has these little flippy things in the front which I'm not a huge fan of. Again, this is from ASOS Swim just like that last swimsuit was. And so what I do when I'm wearing it, I actually tuck these little flappy parts in. I think it's a lot cuter and because it is kind of just like how like it's an unstructured swimsuit top, I think it fits. The only thing is I think the straps are a little big. I don't really have like very broad shoulders, shockingly enough, just because of how my body is shaped. So a lot of the things like this are often made for people I think that have like larger shoulders. And so they add extra room. Whereas for me, I probably could have actually sized down in this, which is really confusing because the straps are very big to the point where I would need to tighten them in the back, but I can't because there's no things. And so I'm wondering, I was like, oh, maybe I can turn it around, but there's not enough fabric in the back. So it would just be like titty, <laughs> like it would just be so much. And I really it's cute, it's fine, it's doable. It's, it's great for all of the swim bottoms that I need a white top for. And that is 100% okay with me. It's not perfect, but it was cheap and I will wear it. And it's something that I can wear and it's not like 100% inappropriate for when I'm around children because fat bodies are also sexualized a lot more than thin bodies. And so it's like, if you have any amount of large cleavage showing, automatically you're more sexualized and you're seen as inappropriate. So it's just better for me and safer for me to wear something like this. And I'm gonna wear what I want anyway. Just not always when I am around kids. So that's it. Um, that's it. That was kind of quick. <laughs> um, I know I was probably talking really fast. I haven't done this in a while. I'm kind of out of practice. With all my free time right now, cause I have a job still, but it's a very chill job right now. Also like, let's be a little bit, I want to always be kind of more loosey goosey and not so structured with how I do things because it's just not realistic for me to be super structured. It's just not, I don't do that well with it. But yeah, that was, all the swimsuits I tried on, I've bought from ASOS. I do have some bottoms, but they're at school right now because I had to abandon the majority of my stuff at my dorm. So I am back home with some things 
and not everything. So there might be another ASOS haul coming soon whenever I go to pick up my shit. But yeah, um, thank you all so much for sticking around. I am so sorry it has been so long since I have posted anything. I was gonna post this video about how I was doing so well and how things were going so great. And I was like living in the city and things were so fun and I was having a great time in grad school. And then that ended and now things aren't great. But again, I'm, I have lots of privilege. Overall, I'm fine. Just a little sad. But you know, what's new? Thank you for sticking around. Thank you for almost 5K. Hopefully we can get there soon. Um, thank you for all the people who keep commenting on my um, Disneyland ride guide help. I'm so glad that that's resonated with a lot of people and it's a bummer that a lot of people didn't really know about it before. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like down below, comment and subscribe. It'd be great to have you here. Again, my name's Renee. Thanks for watching. Bye.